Oh, I wasn't confused at all. I, I liked it. I liked it a lot. It had that swirly, relaxing, sort of hidden in the depths beginning, and then that emo post-rock shift, you know, towards the middle, and I think, uh, you know, quiet, loud dynamics are the way forward. That's the way forward. You're an Arcade Fire fan, as we know, so you no doubt enjoyed that, and uh, there was certainly it. a nod to them in the sound. Well, let me, let's see if you enjoy this next year. Uh, Gossip, of course, have already had a big hit, and uh, this is a follow-up single called Listen Up. Released on 4th of June, that's Gossip and Listen Up. Rufus, you've got a lovely lady back to your place. You're trying to impress her, obviously. You say, uh, oi, oi, here's the new single from, uh, <laughs> Gossip, love. Um, you'll love this. I'm gonna play it for you. Listen up. Is that something you might say? Oh, God, I thought yeah, we'd never, dear. never get to the end of that one. <laughs> To be honest with you, it's been a busy day and I've had a chance to really think this stuff through. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I, 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 uh, as a bassist myself, sure. uh, I love a song which is driven purely by a bass and, and a sexy singer and a, and a bit of a cowbell. As a not very good bassist, I'd be terrified of playing this live because I'd mess it up. Um, but uh, no, I, I really liked how spare it was and how efficient and, and really economical. Lovely. Yeah, very much like uh, the analogy I started the question with. Yeah, a little bit, but not so much. <laughs> yeah. Lolita, um, you were bobbing your head. Is, I was, uh, is I was. Gossip a band for you? I think, uh, do you know what? I've not heard very much of them, but I really like that song. And again, it's the bass. You know, it has a mm. kind of lolling inertia that kind of drags a you along. Lolling inertia? Oh, that's a nine. I'm going yeah, yeah. to use I'm, that. I'm writing that one down. A lolling inertia. Thank you yeah. very much. You, can, uh, you could use that in reference to my... Sex life. Um, <laughs> uh, Harry, what, were your, what was your take on the gossip? Well, I quite enjoyed it, but I thought it was a little half assed which is not an accusation you could ever throw at Miss Ditto herself. No. But it, <laughs> oh. No, I mean, I, I quite enjoyed it, but it, I imagine it would work best in the context, context of a live show where there was a nice hand clap bit, like, yeah. we will rock you, yeah. uh, and then you go to the bar and get a drink before it was one of the really good numbers where she <laughs> exactly, really yeah, yells. Yeah. I mean, I enjoyed it, but nyeh, not as a single. Last week I was decrying the fact that I haven't been given the new Aqualung album, <laughs> but I do owe the Aqualung people half an apology because I was rummaging around in the pigeonhole and I did find this, the first single from that new album. Here it is. It's called uh, Cinderella and it's Aqualung. Prior to that very funky sting, we heard the new single from Matt Hales, a.k.a. Aqualung. It's released on the 11th of June, and it's called Cinderella. Lolita, I'm going to start with you, Thank your you. take on that particular tune. I, uh, you know, Oh my I'm god, I can come up with a the... tortuous analogy. Oh. Uh, hang on, come on, I'm think. Backtrack, backtrack. Um, Jim Davidson famously did a panto called Cinderella. Cinderella. Lolita, would you set now? I no, 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 they're harder than you think, aren't they? They are tough, yeah. Cinderella, did it take you, you to, to the, the ball? ball? Hey! Okay. okay. Nice. Or was it an ugly. No, no. Yeah, no, just, no, just, just one. Just one. Just one. Just just one. one. No, come on, that's yeah, fine. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Bo both of them are impressive. Thanks. Mm. Thank you very much. Well done. Well done. Um, <laughs> slightly patronising. Uh, <laughs> I just wanted to make a note of that. CJ, slightly patronising. Okay, and, um, and, uh, yeah, so what did you make of Matt Hales? Uh, Aqualung. I like Aqualung, but I think I like the more sparse, spare Aqualung rather than the bombastic, uber-produced Aqualung, D though it wasn't unpleasant. Did you feel that he was chasing the Coldplay buck? I think he, ooh, yeah, ooh, you know, I want to, uh, be portal to Aqualung, you know, there okay, might be a bit of a touch a of that. Patronising and sits on fence. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and Rufus, a man who never sits on the fence, he'll have his Batman do that for him. <laughs> uh, what, uh, what do you think of it? Well, I, I, uh, I've liked uh, Aqualung since, or Ar Aqualung, I liked Aqualung. Yeah. <laughs> Aqualung, since, since they were the, the, since they were Ruth in the 45s long time.